All right, everybody, we are doing the Quan Tran Sriracha Honey Butter Chicken. Okay, I got three drumsticks and we're gonna jump right on into the recipe. Okay, he says do a half a cup of buttermilk. Okay. And then he said a couple of tablespoons of fish sauce. Never had had to buy that. So that's one, two. A little extra for fun. Okay. Then the main ingredient, sriracha. He said four tablespoons of that. So Okay, we're doing a teaspoon of chili powder. Put a little bit more. I can take the heat. Okay. And the last ingredient is an egg. Okay. Now we're going to put our handy dandy glove on and we're going to get to mixing, baby. Mix it. All right, he said to marinate this a minimum of three hours. So, you know, I'm going to let this bad boy really get baptized for about five hours. All right, and then we'll move on to the next step. y'all the chicken is marinated and it's time now to do the potato starch I've got the oil over here heating up I use corn oil for everything that I fry stuff in and uh, we'll put the batter on and as it gets hot we'll dip we'll baptize this chicken All right, y'all, we're gonna make the sauce. We're gonna put some mayonnaise up in here. A tablespoon of mayonnaise. He said about two teaspoons of honey. Of course, some sriracha. About two tablespoons. We're gonna do butter. And some paprika. Okay. And that's the sauce. Oh, you know what? Brown sugar. I almost forgot the brown sugar. That's pretty good. All right, y'all. The chicken is done. It ain't as pretty as Quan's because I've got to learn how to cook with the, that uh, potato starch. But we're going to put it on in here. And this sauce. Flip it on around up in here. Get on the flavor train. Get on it the smells absolutely train. wonderful, y'all. 
mm-hmm. get on the flavor, the flavor, the flavor train. Get on the flavor train with your girl, Lady T. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, ah, uh, all right, y'all. Y'all already know what it is. Let's say grace. Thank you, most gracious and heavenly Father, for the food I'm about to receive, for the nourishment of my body, for Christ's sake. Amen. All right, y'all. This chicken looks good. I want y'all to see it up close and personal. <laughs> All right, y'all. Mmm, that is good. <clears throat> Crispy. Ooh, I'll make it even better the next time because now I know how <coughs> that sriracha got a little kick in it. I'll know how to cook it, know how to temper that grease with that potato starch. I've never cooked with potato starch. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's very fine. So when I use that, you gotta you want to make sure your grease is hot, but you gotta start low and then bring it up. Mm. That sauce is awesome. Thumbs up, Quan Tran. This is a good recipe. Mmm, I'm doing good. Chicken onion. Mmm. This sauce will be excellent with chicken onions. Mmm. Any part of the chicken. Very, very crispy. Still hot. I was trying to let it cool down, but I didn't want it to lose its crunch. Wow. That is spot on. Spot on. The flavor. Matter of fact, I can see myself making it hotter. I know there's a pointy bone over here somewhere. Wow. And I'm going to sift through that uh, flour or that starch. Yeah. Ooh, hot. See that steam coming over here?
Y'all don't want smacking and turning on. Well, next time I do this, warning, warning. Because you got to smack and you got to lick your fingers because this sauce is awesome. You could do this sauce on, like, pork tenderloins, too. Yes, 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 yes. I can see myself doing this sauce. On a chicken stir fry. Oh, man. All right, Quan Tram. You better bottle it up. Mmm. I thought, it, I thought it might be too sweet with the honey, the brown sugar, but it's not. If I don't go to my mama's house, y'all, y'all, this video will go up for Sunday dinner. She's still doing a lot with her house. But you know she's going to cook, though, don't you? Oh, yeah. But I'm going to tell y'all. I went down a rabbit hole today. Mmm. looking up information on truth serum i don't ask me why i'm just I ain't trying to find truth serum for somebody but just the different studies on truth serum man i told y'all sometimes i'll just get weird and geeky or just anything you know you just start going down that rabbit hole and it leads you down another rabbit hole Y'all, I love the internet. It's just the information highway, isn't it? But you got to know what sites go on to make sure you're getting accurate information, huh? Hmm. That's the business, y'all. That's the business. good that's a rock in there is good the heat is building but still I can still see where I can put a little bit more kick in it mm. Look, I might have to keep this going. Going on different YouTuber pages and stuff. I'm gonna try that thing. Be loved yet? I really am. I still need to do uh, Lizzie Lou's pizza. 
That's what might be something I'll do next week or something. Give your family something different and yourself, if you will. Something different to eat, you know? I think, what is it? Most households cook the same 10 meals over and over and over and over and over and over and over all year long. Because we like what we like, don't we? Sharp bone to stick me. Don't stick me. Man, that was excellent. Wow, that was excellent. That mayonnaise chicken was good. Out. This was good. I already know Lizzie Lou's pizza. When I went shopping, I, I did actually did Instacart. And totally forgot when I went to the Fraser market to get everything I needed to make this. I totally forgot to grab some yeast. So I thought, and when I did Instacart. So anyway, I'll get to it. I'll get to it. But man, try this. I'll leave Quantran's video. In the uh, description box below of course his chicken fried are very pretty and I know fry I know how to fry chicken real good and fish y'all already know but I've never tried cooking with uh, that potato starch and it's a very fine so you just have to make sure your temperature is kind of low still hot but low and then bring it up so it'll have that pretty golden brown crust but now I know, I know how to treat it. But it still was good. It looked dark, but it wasn't burnt. It just was a dark, darker shade. And that actually gave it an extra kick because with that sweetness on top of it, oh, that brown. Ooh, and I ain't cooked but three pieces. That's all right. Anyway. This was an awesome, awesome recipe. Thanks, Quantran. You know I'm going to be stalking your page now. Uh, he probably don't even know who I am. But anyway, anyway, if y'all know him, tell him. But uh, I'm going to be... He's got a bunch of different fried recipes. I might have to try his Korean fried chicken. Seems like I've seen that over there. What is that in my hair? Oh, that's some, some gel I didn't smooth all the way down. Flim flam. Anyway, y'all, let me go. Whew. And anyway, try some of these recipes from different mukbangers and um, YouTube channels in general. Do something different, you know? It wakes up the taste buds, right? Anyway, I want to thank you for stopping on the flavor train because what? What? Flavor is where it's at. Love y'all. Bye, y'all.